Houston, we have a problem or something. Uh, so the river has turned purple, uh, which is, uh, I think, not so good. Okay, okay, oh, well, 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 welcome back. So as you can see, I have managed to produce the powered cart. So uh, in the previous episode, we have made all the materials needed for it. If you want to know how to make it, so go check the previous episode. Uh, right now we have the cart over here and it looks, uh, I think it looks really awesome. But uh, we have some uh, little problems. It's out of fuel. If we look at the storage, storage has uh, quite a uh, like 10 slots more than a cart, the wooden cart. So it's great, but I need power. In the previous version, like 5.4, I think it, you were able to run it on coal. But right now we would need gasoline or uh, some kind of uh, oil-based uh, fuel. So uh, unfortunately, nobody has the fuel right now. So we need to make the pump jack, uh, oil refinery or something. So petroleum is uh, crafted at the pump jack. So it's a uh, kind of a oil pump or something and then gasoline it's a little better I think uh, more efficient and it's crafted at oil refinery and it's made from petroleum if I understand this thing uh, right uh, you can check here yes five petroleum and you will get gasoline um, so yes we need a pump jack to run this thing right now I can turn the wheel around and do nothing else. Um, another thing, I have noticed that the ground nutrients have been increasing like enormously since we have been doing some steel uh, up there in the blast furnace. So you can see phosphorus has currently 1198. Uh, that's a lot. That's like 1100 more then the usual, this one is like 800 more, 500 more of nitrogen. It's not really normal, um, but uh, well, you know, I guess the pollution will go down because yesterday evening I checked, it was a pollution 5%, now it's pollution zero. Uh, I will see what happens right now. Ooh, I fell down the stairs. I will see what happens when we start producing some more steel and uh, over here I have done this additional room for the cement kiln because uh, I have already started uh, if you check at the storage I have made 25 concrete because we need it for the pump jack so the cement kiln uh, we have made it yesterday in the uh, it's made in the I think it's made in the uh, machine shop uh, we can check later on or check the previous episode so over here you can make concrete uh, if you make the cement kiln, then you have to go to research into masonry over here, and you have the cement kiln, cement processing over here. So I had to research cement processing. I also have to research cement processing efficiency. I mean, I didn't have to research that, but I have invested some 10 points in it. So uh, right now we can do some better efficiency over here. You have cement constructions. So you can make some other things like cement columns, concrete stairs, concrete windows, reinforced concrete. This one looks uh, interesting. Well, I guess we would produce a lot of pollution with that. So, cement kiln has been made. It also needs it needs a chimney raising at least four blocks above the roof, as exactly like the blast furnace. Um, over here, blast furnace machine shop. Is the cement kiln made over here? No, the cement kiln is made in the quarry. We have the quarry downstairs. We're not going to check it right now. So I want to make a pump jack and oil refinery, but I will leave oil refinery for later on. Right now, I just want to get some uh, petroleum so we can uh, drive our cart around. As I have promised, we will drive it around in this episode and we are going to make it. So for the pump jack, uh, we will need all those uh, 20 gears, they are already made. We need 
20 steel. I have tried to buy it, but nobody is selling it. I made an offer in my store, nobody sold me anything. So we are going to make 20 steel and I have already made uh, made uh, 25 concrete. So that's everything all right. Oil refinery, as I said, uh, we will probably be uh, putting this thing up in the next episode since we need to uh, get some petroleum first before we can uh, like make gasoline and you can also make biodiesel from from telos, uh, epoxy recipe and plastics so some awesome future thing here coming in the future I guess um, we will also be making some motors uh, I hope I hope we will be doing that maybe a meteor hits us and uh, we are unable to do anything uh, otherwise I would like to do some uh, uh, let's uh, I mean I would like to do some advanced combustion engines or something I would also like to make a really huge building like try out high how much how high you can build in this game like can you do a hundred blocks high 500 blocks high I don't know if there uh, if we defend from the meteor I will be trying to do that in the future of course when I have more money so I can buy a lot of bricks and concrete to build this huge building right now a pump jack refining over here we need to restart the refining so refining uh, 10 points unlocks petroleum recipe oil refinery pump jack recipe let's unlock that uh, petroleum refining efficiency well I have hundred and twenty four points right now but I will wait with the efficiency since I would like um, so a pump jack over here would require 20 steel uh, and steel is made over here at the blast furnace uh, let's check our blast furnace the first thing do we have power we have a lot of power so crafting uh, steel it right now it requires uh, three uh, if we want to make 20 we would use yeah 52 iron ingots oh look I have exactly 52 but one thing I want to research some efficiency of uh, steel making because as we said steel produces a lot a lot of pollution so under here here under uh, smithing alloy smelting over here we have steel smelting efficiency right now I'm level 2 and uh, if I want to go one level higher that would be 40 points another thing would be steel smelting speed I'm guessing if I upgrade my speed I will produce less pollution since uh, coal and uh, the time consumption of uh, burning the blast furnace will be smaller so I'm going with the speed right now I will go to level 2 I'm also upgrading steel smelting efficiency for 40 points now I have just 50 points left and uh, well you know what either way I want to try how it looks like when my planet is all uh, polluted and everything don't get me wrong but you know it's an alpha point of this game and I want to know what happens when I pollute my my planet not that I would want to but so I when the real version of this game comes out I will be all uh, I will know what happens if pollution comes so let's just make 20 steel that will take some uh, over here it says one hour and five minutes so well we will have to wait some time uh, in the meanwhile I can start the pump jack production over here let's just order it I still need 25 concrete which has been made over here so this uh, cement kiln I think it also produces a lot of uh, a lo I mean not a lot but quite some pollution probably not as much as the blast ferns but since it has a chimney uh, it's probably polluting us so with upgrading uh, steel efficiency for one level we have just uh, like not used 12 iron ingots which is nice mm, storage so we have to carry those two packets of concrete so I can place concrete on the ground Oh, concrete looks nice. Mm. It looks nice. Another thing is, uh, um, I think my neighbor over there won't be so happy about uh, me making all those uh, 
technology and industry stuff so because I'm going to pollute his uh his fields right now I have noticed that pollution happened just down here and in the, the way of the ocean but up there everything is alright but if there would be a situation that a lot of pollution would be happening on our fields I was thinking to move uh, my like you know the dirty production and everything oh shit I fell down okay so I was thinking to move the dirty productions uh, industry and stuff somewhere else like if I check the map right now I am over here I have the fields up here so if I would move myself like down here to the was that S south yeah probably south um, it might be a good idea so we have clean air over here and dirty air down there and uh, who cares about those neighbors over here right I mean I'm kidding but well sometimes you have to look on yourself now uh, let's uh, place the last uh, last ten oh gee I was putting my my concrete in the wrong uh, blast furnace I shouldn't be putting it in the blast furnace I should be putting it in the machine shop now over here this thing will take three hours it's missing 20 steel mm, the cart is waiting down there so uh yeah uh, later on when we will be driving the cart around I will show you we have upgraded the road over here the tunnels are really wide and high right now it's just awesome so uh, when I have the pump jack and uh, still running over here all made up I will be coming back showing you how it works uh, making some petroleum and uh, driving the cart thing since, since the pump jack takes three hours I have decided to cancel the project I will go over here under engineering uh, the primitive mechanics uh, and over here we have mechanics assembly efficiency it will so it doesn't show the pump jack but it's down here and it's really cheap so and another one is mechanics components efficiency we don't need this one because this one is for making gears and uh, like components this one is for making the pump jack so I'm going to increase mechanics assembly efficiency we will use less materials for the pump jack and this one would be speed so pump jack decreases crafting time by zero right now next level 20 uh, let's do this 15% uh, oh for 15 points I can get 35 mm, what do you think uh, should I should I no, I'm not going for this one I'm going for some more efficiency uh, and I will leave the 30 23 points for later now I can do this thing again it uses just 13 steel as we can see so that's that's a lot and just 13 so we have spared seven gears seven steel and um, eight concrete great 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 our pump jack down there has been made but uh, right now I have a little problem and I don't know what to say uh, maybe uh, like uh, Houston we have a problem or something uh, so the river has turned purple uh, which is uh, I think not so good the grass is kinda uh, it has some kind of a whitish undertones and I think it's all from the blast ferns up there uh, if I check the soil levels uh, over here I have well phosphorus is still really high also nitrogen and potassium really high uh, so uh, yeah yeah pollution pollution is happening and it's a real thing this purple water goes back there as long as you can see it's spreading quite fast so well I'm not sure what to do but probably probably I'll just if the too much pollution happens I'll just move my fields away because uh, like burning down my house is like it's too expensive so uh, I'm not planning to do that now over here the machine shop uh, storage we have made the pump jack uh, 
I will just store it over here and we'll go out and try to place it somewhere. Then another thing, I think you need barrels to make uh, to make uh, to pump the oil, uh, the petroleum. So barrels are made at the carpentry table. You also need to make the copper tool shelf and place it somewhere. It's uh, this one over here. I have placed it uh, before. So I made a few barrels. A barrel will cost you right now for me. It's uh, one iron ingot, one pitch and uh, three planks. So I have made five barrels. Uh, now let's let's go let's go and make something something really interesting so if I uh, try to place this thing down if you go with the mouse over it it will say how much oil you have so oil amount 11.45648 uh, I'm not sure how much that is but I would like to go down here so just to move a little away from the house maybe maybe like over here how much oil do we have over here we have 11.2 I don't know let's you know let's just place it over here oh let's check this thing out if we I mean I want to see it first how do you look like it's a nice machine really something huge now if I go into the pump jack hmm. so petroleum would have a barrel one we need one barrel to make one petroleum okay storage have nothing power demand zero watts supply zero consuming consumption thousand watts no no I'm sorry hundred watts so I need a uh, I need power. How do I make how do I make power over here? Hmm. Oh, we will have to figure this thing out. Maybe maybe we can make some kind of a motor or something. Uh, over here. Uh, these doors are really <laughs> not so uh, so good because you have to go around the house and then back in. Oh, over here. If I take a look at this I'm not able to do electronics assembly because I don't have the electronics skills scroll so induction generator would require electric motor which one is the electric motor uh, so electric motor is probably made at the electronics assembly uh, electric motor recipe yes so uh, combustion engine no combustion generator consumes most fuels to produce energy I will I should try this one out I'll just make the combustion generator that would cost us another uh, where is it a combustion engine uh, order a combustion engine uh, order uh, four pistons three four pistons and uh, 13 steel I have some steel over here uh, storage and storage in this one put 13 steel in here uh, so crafting still need a combustion engine and uh, four pistons that would be uh, another two pistons okay one two pistons order so I need four steel plus eight steel plus four steel that's uh, uh what 12 16 steel okay I'll make a uh, 16 steel uh, order now um, I think I have the iron ingots made uh, let's just wait for this uh, combustion generator to be made and uh, I will be back uh, we will be back I'm sorry I didn't know we need electricity for pumping oil yeah we'll be back I have another problem I have remembered that uh, combustion engine uh, combustion engine generator would probably require uh, petroleum or gasoline so uh, uh, this guy here said that he has used used the steam generator to produce the uh, the, the, the electric electricity for the pump jack so I'm going for steam generator first and combustion generator 
will come in later. So mechanics over here uh, will have to be level 3. Uh, I still have some points. Do I want to upgrade? No, not, not right now, right? Combustion generator, cancel project. Uh, combustion engine, cancel project. Uh, cancel. Uh, let's just cancel all of them. Steam generator, order. I still need uh, four pistons. So, piston uh, number four, order. That would be eight still missing. And uh, we'll have to wait for it again. Cheese, see ya. So we've been talking here on the server about different engines. So a uh, combustion generator generates mechanical power which won't work with the pump jack but it might be working with the mills or uh, stuff that needs mechanical uh, uh, power like it could be used instead of a water wheel or a windmill but uh, the steam generator as we know for now will work with the pump jack and also the electric generator or a induction generator over here would work with a pump jack so but for this uh, we need the electronics right now which we don't have so still the steam generator will be the one you want to get your pump jack uh, running at the beginning so let's wait another 21 minutes uh, to make this thing work finally the steam generator is finished and I Sincerely hope we will be able to, well, you know, pump some oil down there. <laughs> now, uh, I will try to put this thing over here. Steam generator object. I guess they have not really completed this thing. So, uh, power would be consuming fuel, power grid, maximum output 200. That's, that's for two uh, oil jacks. And now uh, if I go over here I have mined some coal. Now let's go down there and uh, let's try this thing out. Uh, I'm not so, so sure how it works but uh, I guess we will be able to figure it out. So right now like that if I go under here. I, where do I have my barrels? Storage. No? My barrels? Huh? My barrels? I think I lost my barrels somewhere so I had to make new ones. I have one barrel here. Let's do order. And now this will take 13 minutes and 41 seconds. Now power, uh, supply 200, consuming 100. Uh, is this thing going? Is it working? Oh, it's working! Oh, so supply... I can make another pump jack and uh, pump more oil on this one. So this is a steam generator, uh, an electronic uh, motor or uh, electronic generator, I think it's called electronic generator, uh, would produce uh, also the needed power for the pump jack, but you will need some uh, gasoline or uh, petroleum to run it. So I went for the steam generator at first. Uh, and later on, uh, maybe, probably, I'll be making the uh, the uh, electronic motor. But we need to research the electronics first. Now, uh, this thing will take 15 minutes to make this petroleum over here. We are at 6% right now. Finally, back on uh, this uh, pump jack over here has finished some uh, petroleum project in this storage. I have, well, I have just one of them. But uh, that will be enough for... Uh, for trying out the powered cart over here. If we go, you can, you need to go to this back edge of it and press E under power. If I put this petroleum in here, that will do for, I'm not sure how, man, how much time we can drive with it, but we can try. It's not working. Hmm. Well, let's see. So power. It looks good, but we can't drive around. Why? Uh, if I check the status, currently polluting, lifetime pollution, it's all fine, but it's not drive. Oh, now we go. Nice. But, uh, ooh, 
it's a little like not totally under control it slips a little I almost fell over oh shit no 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 come on let's go you can do it oh 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 no please it's a uh, little clumsy but uh now now we go okay so for the end of this episode we can check out the road we've been making it's connecting our town to Crisius and uh, all the other towns basically we are almost connected around the world but well this cart is a little it's hard to drive it because it doesn't go in the w direction you would want it to go but, uh, okay it's it's going oh and the tunnel is a uh, it's a little it's not high enough but okay now I can see how 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 big the mountain is and uh, you can see our tunnel over here uh, we will probably be uh, digging out another block of stones so this ride over there right around here will be a little more uh, convenient uh, enjoyable how do you call it enjoyable would be a an enjoyable ride oh it's quite c complicated I was uh, thinking this card would be really really a cool one but right now I see it's a uh, well it's fast but I will have to get used to it uh, so it's a little it tends to go in its own direction but I guess that will do because you know speed is a good speed is a good thing over here we will spend a lot less time traveling from one town to another uh, so we are almost here that didn't took us that much time so uh, I guess that will be it for today over here we have Chris used town let's see if he has made his uh okay we can go through but he will have to update this building over here if we want to make this thing really working properly oh no I hit the lamp well anyway I will try to get used to this uh, cart over here and I will see you around in the next uh, episode coming out I don't know tomorrow probably uh, so uh, see you